All right, y'all, so what's up and what's good, party people? It is your host with the most. Paul King 2 coming at you guys straight banging a little Hwayne. Holy shit! Holy shit, I almost hit a bird! Oh my god, that peregrine falcon almost got clipped. But uh, I'm coming at you guys with another trip to the thrift video. It's called Aquaberry Freshness because just know I have my Charlotte Hornets gear on deck. So I'm going to hit up a bunch of thrift stores in this vid and just show you guys what's crap tating up in Austin. Dude, this is my pet peeve. When there are two slabs going turtle pace next to each other. Dang, can't nobody pass you guys up like that. Like you're getting passed up by someone who's handicapped. Like, no offense to any handicapped people, but, like, come on, man. You know they're probably elderly. Dude, throwing it back, these are my first pair of, like, vans I ever got. But, uh, going into Thrift Town right now, a.k.a. Trip Town, 99 cent sale on t-shirts, trunks, and all tanks. So, uh, just know about to utilize that, uh, discount code right there. All right, I'm up in this thing. They got this, uh, Colts Diamond Mitch one. Um, yeah, they got that Eeyore. Oh, strap back in burgundy. I don't know, they don't really have too much else that I see. What? They don't have like any shoes. I mean, they got these, but they're like size like 28, so. Nah, that ain't me. And then Skechers Tim's. Dude, they got that pimp coat. Freaking silk shiny velvet glistening in the light <laughs> look at that fish fetish like this shirt is straight sardine all up on the frame Ooh, so check out what i saw from a distance i knew it was something dope what is it dallas cowboys starter jacket look at this it is a bit stained but i can clean that up nfl pro line eight dollars size medium look at that Hell yeah. Look at this jacket. $2.99. Watch, watch this. Holy ball sack. This jacket is throwed. It's just... So this Timberland shirt with the laces embroidered in <laughs> isn't dope. <laughs> like, what? Who does that? Dude, this collared crew neck on the cool though, this thing is fancy. Straight up building a FUBU fit over here at Thrift Town. You feel me? Oh, what's up with it? I finally caught Trip Town slipping because I got this dope starter cowboy jacket for only, what? Eight bucks? What? Who is doing the price check on that? And I got this UNC, like super dope, like embroidered in Tar Heel varsity leather jacket for three dollars are you joking me like somebody must be blind or like someone is new and hasn't been trained well but it's 2x but i'm actually sending this to my homie oliver shout out to you you little fool at thrift land right now i look like the biggest charlotte hornets fanboy of all time but i ain't even tripping but i'm gonna have to record on this sneak because they sometimes trip when I'm in there uh, recording, so I'm gonna have to do it on the slide for you guys. So no blatant uh, pics of scenery or anything like that, but I'm about to go and see what I can find. Two bucks. Not bad. Then they got a McNabb for only five bucks. Dude, check it out. They got a Celtics football jersey by Majestic. Celtics. NBA. It's pretty random. They got a vintage Drew Bledsoe Patriots jersey for 10 bucks. Local Athletic Bledsoe crap. And the kids, there's this Boston Red Sox jersey for 2 bucks. This is a sick patch to use, guys. I could easily make a Boston Red Sox jacket by putting that on an all like navy or all red or all white plain jacket. Then check it out. For three bucks, you could get the letters Red Sox as well. This is an all custom right here, man. And the B, you can straight up make a custom jacket just out of like these two like five dollar together items. This is another prime example of something to customize. Four dollar size large plain satin jacket and a small like embroidered design right there. They can easily cover up with a patch. So I'm gonna cop this. 
traffic. Looking for my chapstick. All I got at that last thrift store was um that blue jacket, which I'm gonna customize with something as uh, soon as I come up with a really dope idea. So it always is good to have customizable materials, you feel me? So uh, really glad I have that. And now I am going to go to Salvation Army, I do believe. Hey, welcome to South Texas, boys and girls. We got cacti and all this random shrubbery. All right, I'm at a Salvation Army Family Thrift Store. Once again, they're trying to compete with the Goodwill foliage, scenic, straight up jungle book looking landscaping game. Welcome, about to go in. Oh, that candy red shopping cart. Oh. I got this Ishmael Cowboys jersey. Huh, straight military game, comfortable. <laughs> I'm corny, Operation Desert Storm. Shit, man, clumsy. This picture is trippy as balls. Like, it's Mary made out of Juan Diego. <laughs> it's Jesus made out of an ass. Like, what? Oh, for the win. Oh, wait. Oops. And this is when I leave. Holy crap, guys. I just made a really stupid ass purchase. I just bought a fucking, sorry about my language, wolf at the thrift store. <laughs> look at this, <laughs> look at this shit. <laughs> and it has like a broken leg. All right, so they went in, so I saw this on the table. I was like, that's ridiculous. It looks like something I would buy. They wanted $40. I was like, hell no. Nah. Bullshit. And so I went up to him and I was like, hey, <laughs> you know, I hate when customers do this, but I had to hit him with the, hey, you got a broken leg though. I was like, you got, you got me with the discount? So the dude, the like manager guy was like, I'll give it to you for 20 bucks. I was like, 20 bucks? I was like, it's a three-legged wolf. You only giving me half off? And then he was like, the people in the back might be able to fix it. I'm like, no, nah, man, that crack is, is like crazy. It's like, it's like crucial detrimental to the health of that wolf. <laughs> and so then the, the chick at the register is like, how about 14.99? So I got to 15 bucks and the guy was like, man, I was like, I can't do 15 bucks on that. I was like, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm getting it because it's ridiculous. I can't do 15 bucks on it if the leg falls off. And then he was like, well, what can you do on it? He's like, because I can't go below 15. And I was like, I was going to hit him with 10, but I knew he would probably be like, oh, hell no, and just quit talking to me. So I was like, I mean, I, I go $12, man. I was like, what's $3 between friends? <laughs> and I just started talking to this guy. And he was like, no, nah, 15 is the lowest I can go. I was like, 15? And then he's like, yeah, it's only $3 difference. I was like, man, I don't know, man. He's like, all right. He's like, uh, I'll go $13.99 to be fair. I was like, $13.99, that's only a dollar difference. He's like, all right, you can have it for $12.99. I was like, yes. So it's still stupid as fuck, but I'm going to hold it up once I get back to the crib. Because, it. I mean, look at that face, though. That thing is straight desperado. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, I got a wolf for $13 at the thrift store today. I don't know what the hell I was thinking, but I guess because I'm making bank now, I can do that, even though I'm really not. But I got a wolf, so there you go. <laughs> yeah, and I also got these shades. They're like five bucks, which is ridiculous, but I really wanted some shades like that look like this. So I had them last year, a pair like this, and I lost them. So uh, I had to cop these bad boys. Oh, need a mosquito. I just found another Goodwill. Dude, so what you guys think about these glasses? No, this is straight throwback to last summer, so uh, definitely had to cop them. But yeah, about to get my bridal dress game on. LOL. This is a flashback to that little kinky twist thrift video. The exact same shirt. All right, that Goodwill sucked balls. Like, they didn't have anything. It was sparsely populated by objects. And like, like literally that Goodwill didn't have ish besides that one shirt that I showed off. I hate going, that's why I hate Goodwills, dude. Shout out to Blanco. What? No! I dropped the camera again and I hit the brake too hard and I think my wolf's leg is just fully freaking amputated now. No! Fido straight took a hit on that brake check. Uh, someone play Frank Ocean because I'm in that VIP parking space and they are hiring. All right, so the only jerseys they got is this Dallas Stars one for six bucks. And then this Notre Dame. They got this Champion XL Patriots jersey. And it is 
catching the money out of the house. That's my dad's outside. They got that red suit jacket. I think straight stands out. But they also have a vintage snapback in here for once. By uh, Top of the World right there. This UT one with the Longhorn embroidered. Definitely old school. But I think it might be a kid's hat because it looks pretty small. It's 99 cents though. So if it fits, I'm going to get it. Dude, so I got this size XL biker jacket. Look at that patch game, dude. This thing is so sick. Like, dude, the thread count on this is out the ass. Like, dude. But they want $45, which might be an all right price, but not for a thrift store. But I mean, this jacket is just, this thing is baller, dude. All right, so I'm in the shoe aisle, right? Freaking kids. I'm in the shoe aisle right now. And look what they got. They got these Jordans right here, like sevens. With the clear. If that kid does not shut the fuck up. But yeah, they got these clear Jordan seven, sevens. And whoever thought this was a good idea was an idiot. These are those shoes that you would put your sock in there and then it would fill up with the steam from your hot ass feet and just look trifling as hell. But I mean, these are pretty sick still. What I would do with these is I'd buy them and I'd paint that. That way you can't even see through it. And then you have a dope Jordan 7. These are size seven and a half though, way too small for me. But sick little fine. Let's see, what else do they have? They have these fake Air Force One turds. So my camera died in savers and all they had there that I didn't show off was a pair of uh, Jordan 1s. They weren't anything like too special. They are pretty like jacked up, size 13, so I didn't cop them. But uh, yeah, Texas Thrift. Straight out of Hong Kong, that South Pole 2XL. Jean jacket with the graffiti. <laughs> Dude, this is sick for all you soccer fans. This Arsenal jersey for five bucks. Old school, back with the O2 on it. For two bucks, we got an XL Dolphins tee right there in the tie-dye pattern. National Aquarium in Baltimore. Hell yeah. I got this sick Scarface shirt with the skeletons and their Glocks and shotguns and AKs, M16s, ARs. Bazookas. This thing is really sick. It looks like it glow in the dark too. Are you joking me? They got this same shirt at this thrift store too. This dog is no love. They got that Ed Hardy game. On point. Look at that freaking bedazzled dragon. They got a couple of Hawaiian shirts. This one is really sick. It says Hawaiian. And then it says Aloha, Land of Aloha. You got some like kid fours right here. I'm gonna have to get these and customize them for when my little my little children grow up. They got the Terminator freaking record on deck. Arnold. That boy Fido guarding the hoop. Alright, as you guys can see, I'm uh I'm back from that thrifting adventure. My camera died outside of uh Thrift Town, I don't know why it was going so low on battery. But anyways, all I got were those three jackets and of course Fido the Wolf, which I'm gonna do a restoration video on. But once again, in case you forgot, jackets, starter jackets, you know what it is. So once again, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And it's your host with the most, making you guys dizzy, signing out, and saying peace and love out there, party people. Stay tuned, more videos dropping soon. I'm out.